Hi and welcome to another Premier League prediction video. This is the match between Crystal Palace and Watford. The match is played Saturday the 12th of January 2019 and it's a match in match week 22. So let's check the team's previous result. Crystal Palace won with 2-0 away against Wolverhampton last match week. And Watford drew 3-3 away against Bournemouth last match week. Let's also check the current table. Crystal Palace is currently at 14th place with 22 points and Watford is at 8th place with 29 points. And I'm actually going with Crystal Palace here and I'm going with a result of 3 to 1. So let's see what FIFA 19 has to say about it and enjoy the video. A welcome to one of the noisier grounds in English football. It's not the biggest, but the supporters are so passionate. Selhurst Park, the home of Crystal Palace Football Club. And Alan Smith and I, Martin Tyler, will be trying to keep our voices above the din so that you can hear our commentary. James Tomkin. Coming up now, Crystal Palace against Watford. Well, a couple of star names that we're looking at today. What do you think, Alan? Oh, I love watching this pair play. They haven't disappointed this season. They've been the most threatening players for me, for both their teams. Maximilian Meyer. Number 10, Andros Townsend. And number 11, Wilfred Zaha. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Wayne Hennessy plays in goal. Mamadou Sacco plays with James Tompkins as the centre back. And it looks good in attack with these two strikers. Thank you, Selhurst Park. Here's Watford, and this is how they're going to line up. So we have 4-4-2 against 4-4-2. It is a throwback match. It is indeed. And I just wonder who's going to come out on top. And it does inevitably come down to who plays the better on the day. Referee starts the match and the kickoff. Deflected out for a throw. James MacArthur. Milivojevic. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. He's got support here. The shot's on! Well, they know their positions here. They know their jobs defending this corner. Decided that this time they're going to play the short corner. He's got his shot off now. Super goal. It's offside. That's what the assistant has said. Well, when he looks back on that, I think he might be a bit disappointed because the striker seemed to time his run really well. Well, we can see it again, Alan. Well, it's so difficult, these decisions by the assistants, but I think he's got that one right. Well played. Etienne Capu. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. One or two players looking at each other there as to why that attack broke down. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there, and pass goes straight to the opposition. Pereira. Well, here is the birthday boy. Dini, De La Feu, going forward well, decided to go infield, looking dangerous, good defensive clearance there, bit of space to go forward into with the ball, and here's the shot, 
And that's deflected behind. It will be a corner. Corner played in. Really commanding goalkeeper, and that's easy for a player of his ability to catch the corner. Townsend. James MacArthur. Milivojevic. Sheku Kuyate. Tackle goes in. Making sure there's no turnover. It's one back. Zaha. I think the cross is on. Kuyata. And now the shot. Well, he's knocked it in. And they've got the lead now. It hasn't come easily. But they're delighted with it. It was a well-crafted move. And a fine finish at the end of it. And the keeper's got no chance because he's hit it so hard to his right. Different angle on it here. And that has opened the scoring. One nil here. Number eight, Jay Kapka. Carrera. Dini. Throw in to come. James MacArthur. That's a combination of skill and will to hold off the opposition. Townsend. Milivojevic. Kuyate. That's an easy cut out for the opposition, saw the pass coming. Pereira. Etienne Capu. Great cut cut. Dini. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Milivojevic, Andros Townsend, trying to get the ball in behind. Going to try one now, two in front now. Well, keep the concentration and they've won this match, I think. A goal from Zahar, and look at the net pulled in there, because he has blasted that hole from outside the box. Another angle on it here. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Goal for Crystal Palace, number 11. Mariapa. Got to pass the ball a bit better than this if they're going to make progress, giving it straight away. Andros Townsend. James MacArthur trying to find an opening, not panicking. Challenge in sharp. Now Hughes. Well, now they've got the ball, what are they going to do with it? Townsend. Hughes, De La Feu, Etienne Capu. Room now out on the wing. Gets his cross in, and they get it away.
Milivojevic. Andros Townsend. Townsend. Proper tackle that. Dini. Pereira. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area. It'll be a throw. No nonsense clearance from the defender. Hughes. Pereira. Etienne Capu. Now this is... Shot off! Well, there's still time if they can get this goal. And it's in the net for the goal! Well, they look pleased with themselves, and no wonder the way they stroked the ball about and created the finish, picked out the spare man in the box. Well, this is what you call leading from the front. A strike from the skipper. Yeah, he's popped up at a very good moment there. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. Off we go again, 2-1. Goal for Watford, number nine, Troy Deeney. Sacco. Meyer. Meyer. And that's good support as they build this attack. Oh, they get there first. Going to try his luck. Well, a corner to come because of that deflection. Corner's taken. Good defensive clearance there. Max Meyer. Kuyate. And here's the shot. He really gave it the laces there, didn't he, Alan? Yeah, he did connect with it beautifully. Not a bad effort at all. Etienne Capu. Well, he saw the guy he could switch the play to and came up with the pass as well. Excellent. It's given away. Patrick Van Arnholt. They can be quick on the break now. James MacArthur. Careless there. And the ball is played back to Foster. Well, I thought so, there'd be a good chunk added on. It's going to be four minutes. Four minutes. The shot's on. Well, that could be the insurance goal here. That little bit of daylight that they were after. Well, it's ended up in the back of the net, quite high up too. Yeah, I'm not sure whether we actually meant it just to... Go under the bar, maybe we'll find out afterwards. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, Goal the scorer. Crystal Palace, number 18. Craig Kafka. Dini, Etienne Capu, Hughes, trying to find a way through here, probing away, Pereira, any danger to the goal has gone with that clearance, half-time whistle has gone, and it's 3-1 here.
Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. I'll be happy with that first 45 minutes. It was a good goal from him, good overall performance, actually. The shot's on! Well, they know their positions here, they know their jobs defending this corner. He's got his shot off now. Super goal. It's offside. That's what the assistant has said. Well, when he looks back on that, I think he might be a bit disappointed because the... I think the cross is on. Kriyate. And now the shot. Well, he's knocked it in. And they've got the lead now. It hasn't come easily. But they're delighted with it. It was a well. Andros Townsend trying to get the ball in behind. Going to try one now. Two in front now. Well, keep the concentration, and they've won this match, I think. Now this is a cut off. Well, there's still time if they can get this goal. Max Meyer, Kuyate, and here's the shot. He really gave it the laces there, didn't he, Alan? Yeah, he did connect with it beautifully. Not a bad effort at all. Well, I thought so. There'd be a good chunk added on. It's going to be four minutes. The shot's on. Well, that could be the insurance goal here. That little bit of daylight that they were after. The start now of the second period. Now Hughes. It's a poor touch and the possession's gone away. Max Meyer. He's given it away. Etienne Capu. Well, they could pose some danger now. Pereira. That looked dangerous until he made the interception. Sheku Kuyate. Meyer. Patrick van Arnhol. Milivojevic. Andros Townsend. James MacArthur. Zaha. Opportunity here. Still a chance in there off the... That was a puff-out-your-cheeks moment and... Phew. Got away with it. Meyer. He's got a chance to cross. Put in from the wide area. Well, the cross looked good, but it didn't turn out that way. You can see what he was trying to do. Just stretch the opposition by getting the ball out wide, but it's gone out for a throw. James Tompkins. Milivojevic. Patrick van Arnholt, Max Meyer. That's his game, isn't it? Intercepting. Dini. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. Pereira. Townsend. Meyer, Patrick Van Arnholt. Crystal Palace are going to make an alteration. There's a substitute coming on. Craig Cathcart. De La Feu. Etienne Capu. 
Shots on here. Well, that's gone behind. It'll be a corner. Put the corner in the middle. Pereira only partially cleared, so there's still some problems for them. Interception hit. James Tompkins. Milivojevic. Townsend. Andros Townsend. James MacArthur. Looking for teammates in the middle. Defended well. Here's a chance to attack. Cleared it well. Meyer. Andros Townsend. Let in the shot go! He'll be a lot happier having made that save after some earlier unconvincing moments. Yeah, he'll be relieved as well because he's been getting a bit of stick from the fans behind the goal. But uh, a rare little uh, bout of applause for him. Corner's taken. It's wonderful work from the goalkeeper again from the header. Well, he was on his toes. He was ready for it. Good stop. Etienne Capu. Craig Kafkar. Andros Townsend. Milivojevic. Sheku Kuyate. James MacArthur. Whipped in from the wide area. Off the post. And the ball's in. It's a goal. I think this is the kind of player he's got the kind of ability that you know if you can get the ball out to him, he will deliver an end product. And he did there, didn't he? Well, that's put them further in front and nicely taken. Certainly was. And uh, they seem to be heading for comfortable lead here and we can see a slightly different viewpoint on it One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Number 10, Craig Kafka. Dini. Well, I like the look of this attack. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. And now the shot! That so effort rather reflected their place. mood Coming in this match, which has gone wrong for them. Number 10, Andres Townsend. Coming onto the pitch. Number 14, Jordan Ayew. It's a good place to win the ball here. Milivojevic. Sheku Kuyate. James MacArthur. Oh, it's lovely passing this and knocking the ball around with such confidence. Yeah, it's the understanding between those players down there. They seem to be reading what each is going to do before they've done it. Pereira. Palace about to make a change here. He's got it back again from his teammate. Jordan Ayu. Sheku Kuyate. Saka, Milivojevic. It's not often you get guiding it through. Had to be brave coming out there, the goalkeeper. Temp had a crack. 
James Tompkins. Sheku Kuyate. Milivojevic. Well, for me, Alan, this guy's playing uh, really at the top of his game. Do you think so? It looks that way, Martin. He cannot get enough of the ball. He's dominating things out there. Cleared away by the defender. It's looking good, this move. Meyer. Now he's looking for support. Patrick Van Arnholt. Opportunity now. That was a puff out your cheeks moment and phew got away with it he could cross it now James MacArthur Jordan Ayew Milivojevic show the first part show your appreciation for today keeper's ball no question about that it's a weak cross really Townsend Jordan Ayew gives it away 88 minutes played here they've lost the ball and the counter attack could be there and up goes the board there'll be two added minutes safety first there put into the middle well, that's the keeper's ball from the moment the cross left his foot. Well, that's it, the final whistle. Well, we've given you the scoreline, the bottom line, it's a defeat. It is, and that dressing room will be a sad old place at the moment, a quiet one, I think, as it sinks in. And they'll just be looking ahead now, or they will be, uh, to the next match and hope for better things. Some final thoughts on one of the better performers today, Alan. You could see his teammates were always keen to get the ball to him, and why wouldn't they be in the kind of form he showed? Got his goal, took it really well, hit the woodwork. He was their man of the match, without a doubt. He's got his shot off now. Super goal. It's offside, that's what the assistant has said. Well, when he looks back on that, I think he might be a bit disappointed because the... I think the cross is on. Kuyate. And now the shot. Well, he's knocked it in. And they've got the lead now. It hasn't come easily. But they're delighted with it. It was a well... Andros Townsend, trying to get the ball in behind. Going to try one now. Two in front now. Well, keep the concentration, and they've won this match, I think. Now, this is a shot on. Well, there's still time if they can get this goal. I thought so, there'd be a good chunk added on. It's going to be four minutes. The shot's on. Well, that could be the insurance goal here. That little bit of daylight that they were after. Etienne Capu. Shot's on here. Now that's gone behind, it'll be a corner. in from the wide area off the post and the ball's in it's a goal